Welcome on board to the Meta Instinct channel. In this video, we'll discuss ship parts and share some exciting news about Paxify. Ship parts play a critical role in enhancing your ship's performance, and we'll cover the fundamentals and provide tips on acquiring better ship parts. Parts. We can equip a ship with four parts, cannon, figurehead, helm, and sail. These parts come in three qualities, rare, epic, and legendary. Legendary parts are the best quality and are hard to obtain initially. Still, you can acquire them easily after playing the game for two weeks without spending money if you follow our tips, which we will cover later. Apart from quality, there are two levels on a ship part, enhancement and requirement. First, we can enhance a ship part with starlight shards up to 15 enhancement levels. The enhancement level is displayed in the upper right corner of the part. By leveling up, we can unlock up to three attributes and increase the stats of the ship part. However, the attributes, except the first one, are always the same across the same part. For instance, all cannons have base impact, attack bonus, impact bonus, and critical rate. Only the first attribute can be different. For example, the Sovereign Sail has three different first attributes, Sail Speed, Armor Bonus, and HP Bonus. Hence, the comparison is easier because we only need to compare the first attribute. Starlight Shards look like stones, which we can obtain when completing the incident while exploring the map. But we might be short of them initially, we will get sufficient shards when the gate opens. Additionally, we can recycle the low quality and unused parts to get some shards or select them as the material to enhance a part. Furthermore, every part has a requirement level, and we cannot upgrade this level because is fixed. It is displayed at the bottom right of the part, and our ship level must meet the requirements for its use. The higher requirement level part provides better stats. For example, a level 20 cannon provides 250 base attacks while a level 15 provides 200. It gives a significant boost to our fleet and CP. Therefore, we must replace the ship part when we receive a better one. We can consume the old one when enhancing the new part. A seasonal hero like Griffin may cost over 300 US dollars from the Himkonk bundles, but we get them for only 225 US dollars, thanks to the sponsor of this video, Paxify. Paxify is a Discord community with over 10,000 members that saved players over $4.1 million over the last three years. And guess what? They're launching an app that makes getting discounts effortless. It will be launched in April. It's the first specialized app and the Paxify team has prepared special bonuses for our community. Here's why we're excited. Enjoy an additional 15% savings on top of regular discounts for a limited time. Test the service with 500 credits. No credit card is required. VIP status on both the app and Discord. Beta players can look forward to extra perks. Be the best and receive extra rewards as a trophy. If you're leading an alliance or playing at a very high level, expect special offers tailored to make your team even stronger. The app brings things to the next level with features like a two-click sign-up, real-time order tracking, human support, reordering in just three clicks, and one currency for all games. The spots are limited, so don't miss out. Hit the link in the description to join the waiting list and secure your exclusive perks. Play smarter with Paxify. Set. In Sea of Conquest, players can collect various sets of ship parts. You must select four parts from the same set to receive set bonuses. For instance, if you collect four pieces of Blade of Freedom, your ship's impact will increase by 15%, while its attack will increase by 18%. These bonuses are essential to optimize your ship's performance, so choose them wisely. Each set offers different buffs. In S1, Blade of Freedom and Sovereign of the Sea are the only sets players can obtain after the February patch. These two sets are universal, meaning they can be used on any damage type and ship. The developers reduce the number of sets in S1 to avoid confusion among new players. However, in S2 and onwards, we should have access to more sets. We will provide more information on the set buffs in the Hero Lineup series. Tips First, don't kill a low-level C monster alone because you can't kill the strongest one. Teamwork is vital to achieving the best possible rewards. You can join an active gang and invite members to kill the top-level C monsters. All members will receive the same rewards, regardless of the damage they deal. Higher level C monsters offer more adventure experience and ship parts. The orange flag on the map indicates the location of the top level C monsters. For instance, the highest level C monster in S1 is level 38. Additionally, you can check when a higher level C monster will be unlocked from the Grand Odyssey. Double rewards. Suppose you can earn 5 rewards daily by defeating 5 C monsters. 
If you have subscribed to Jade Blessing, you can earn 6 instead. If you don't complete the daily rewards, you will gain double cards corresponding to how much you've missed. For example, if you defeat only 3 out of 5 sea monsters, you will receive 2 double cards in your inventory after the reset. You will be prompted to use the double card to gain double rewards. If you don't want to use it, you can untick the option and save it in your inventory. Please keep in mind that the maximum storage of these cards is 10, and you cannot save more than that. They can be helpful when you know that higher level sea monsters are coming soon. For example, a level 20 sea monster provides 700 adventure experiences and one ship park chest. A level 22 sea monster provides 750 adventure experiences and two ship park chests. Save the cards for level 22 sea monsters if you know they are coming tomorrow. You can get two ship park chests instead of one and an extra adventure experience. Alright, is the end of the sharing today. Please subscribe and stay tuned. I'm Alan from Meta Instincts. See you soon. Accelerated adventure in the world of pirates.